and spun and elevated. You can see the spring that she has. KK Dean splashes it in from the left wing. And when they have the opportunity to get out and run, they do, but that time nobody was in a hurry to get down the court. Natasha Mack, she is a problem. Mack was like three feet off her and she decided to drive into her and got her shot blocked, and then that time she drove in and had a shot clock violation. I think overall you're happy your team is involved in the game, Absolutely. paying attention and engaged. Yes, yes. We got a one-point game. Gondrasek on the feed from Martinez. That you lose a big score with Madison Smith, but you do lose a big leader and a good point guard. Great feed over the top from Fields to Delap. They're still up six. It, it certainly hasn't been a clean game really for either side. And you see that right there. Asbury gives it right to Martinez. That's an easy bucket. Taylor Collins' father, Terry, played for Oklahoma State when they went to the Final Four back in 95. He shot from, not took the feet from Gondrzejk on the last possession. She has 15 points. Couple blocks. Here's the dynamic duo, now feeds Deans. Oh my goodness, KK Deans. Very comfortable in the mid-range game. They lob it to Mack, that was too easy. I think Edgefor kind of lost her. Martinez wants it mid-range, hits from Gondrasek. A high five from the dynamic West Virginia duo. Through traffic to set her up. Asbury for three, big shot goes for Jamie Asbury. I think today the defense is you know, allowing West Virginia to get close to the basket and then Natasha Mack just cleaning things up. And how about that? KK Deans banks it in. The West Virginia Mountaineers are on to the Big 12 Championship tomorrow against the Baylor Lady Bears.